Hey, I'm Trish. I'm going to do a true crime reading today on a missing child, um, a missing boy. Thank you, Kimberly, for sending me the message. Um, his name is Michael Joseph Vaughan. He's from Fruitland, Idaho. He was five when he disappeared. And he disappeared on the 27th of the 7th around 6.30 or 7 p.m. So we're just going to tap in and have a little look here, see what I can see. Now, last night I did tap into a... Um, a young boy. I'm not sure if you've related here or not. I'll, I will see. I had a headache last night, but I did have a young boy coming to me last night. The young boy was wearing like a light colour top with a pattern. I couldn't make the pattern out, but it had bands on the shirt. He had a shirt and shorts on and he had a bands, coloured bands on the shirt that he was wearing. Um, and he was pointing to his teeth at me. So he, he looked to be around five or six to me because he looked like he had baby teeth, but perhaps he was missing a tooth because not that I could see a missing tooth, but he was pointing to his mouth, is what he was doing. But I had a headache, so I couldn't hold the connection for very long. So I don't know if that was him. Um, if it is, I'm hoping that he comes back today. But I'm going to tap into that energy of Michael Joseph Vaughan. And we'll see what we can see. Okay. So I'm using my investigation oracle here. Okay, so what the cards here are indicating is that there was a level of stra strategy or planning that took place here. It says Stranger Unknown. So that indicates that um, it was someone that he didn't know. That is also my card for in um, like stormwater drains as well, that card there. I am seeing um, like walking, holding hands with somebody. Okay, there seems to be a different perspective here. So, and, and I think that's related to the evidence. So it's like almost looking for evidence or a statement, but there's a different perspective around the evidence here. Okay, I'm feeling um, Sarah here in this evidence, So, and I'm hearing the word wrong, so wrong. I think that the way they put together the evidence or the chain of events was different. It was slightly different, but I'm hearing wrong, seeing next to the card of different perspectives, so different, different. Doesn't mean wasn't involved. It means that the way the scenario was in the evidence, put together in the evidence, was wrong or different. Um, okay, there's an expansion happening here. You need to expand the situation out a little bit more. I don't know if that's the search to be perimeters, to be expanded is what I'm hearing. Expand, or the 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 story that the the evidence. I'm seeing statement here in the cards. So I need to expand out that statement. I had another word in there, was similar to expand. I lose it if I don't say it straight away. Some they're talking to me now. Something about goals. What are the goals and the objectives here is what they're saying. We've got to go back to the source. They're saying go back to the source. So I don't know if that is the source of where the statements came from. 
or the original evidence, but go back to the source. A fine tooth comb, they're saying, so, or finer details. So it's fine tooth comb or fine, finer details. They need to go back to the source of the original evidence or original statements and expand on that in some way or go over it in finer detail. They're missing something. There's a missing link. Um, I don't know if that's covered or buried. Covered up or buried. And it's about where the fingers are pointing, they're saying. The allegations or where the fingers are pointing. I'm not going to interpret that. I'm just going to give what I'm hearing. I'm hearing something about a street now. Cold is what I'm hearing, so I don't know if it's a cold case or cold hearted, but I'm hearing cold, cold. But it doesn't feel cold temperature like he's cold. That's not what I'm feeling. I'm feeling either cold case or cold hearted. Something about taking back what they've already done or taking something back in some way. It's maybe a piece of statement or evidence. Are they taking back what they said or something's been taken back? Taken back could be the body. That's my interpretation of the word. I feel like I'm talking to somebody older. I don't feel like I'm talking to a child here. I feel like I'm talking to somebody older. Okay. Let's see if he is still alive. my buried card um, it's completed ended it's the world card so it means the end of a, end of a cycle end of a situation has ended but it's also my buried in the earth card and unaware oblivious has come out for the second time okay let's let's clarify what you mean by unaware oblivious what does this mean okay I'm seeing in this picture this person has their eyes closed um, Eyes closed again here too is indicating deceased. Um, eyes closed. Suspect of the motives. Unaware of the motives or unaware of the suspect. This is a group, a social group. Again, strategy and planning took place. Whether that strategy and planning that took place before the event or after, it says similar. Um, again, this is walk away, run away. Almost like walked away with somebody because where I saw that card, the, the lovers, where they're walking along the dirt path with holding hands, this one here is walking away with somebody or walking along with somebody.
um, this is like Woodlands Dirt Woodlands. It says alone, it's the fill card. Um, fill card can be naivety, um, something new, something different. I'm not feeling that here. I'm feeling like it's um, wooded area dirt. I was asking if he was alive and it says no. This is my no card. Okay, why why did why did he get taken? Okay. Deal with the devil. Uh, there's a level of regret here. Whether it didn't, they regret making that deal. But a level of contemplation went into this as well. Okay, this is the hanged man. Hanged man means delays and suspensions. Okay, I'm getting, I'm sending really bad vibes off this card. I don't want to go into details like that, but I'm just sending really bad vibes off this card. Unseen, this is blindfolded. All of these cards are looking down in a sense of um, almost like regret or Okay, there's an awful feeling in the pit of my stomach here when I'm tapping into a person. I actually feel female. I'm feeling female energy there. Um, eaten away at my stomach, so it's like a sense of remorse or some kind of sense that's eating away at my stomach. It's eating away at me. I'm thinking with the blindfold card, maybe they didn't realise the full extent of this picture of what, what would happen. Okay. I just want to tap into the energy of Sarah. I don't know if that's who I was tapping into there or not, but I just want to... The person that was arrested, let off arrested again so and let off again I think she was I think I'm not too sure about it I didn't look too much into the case because I prefer to go in a little bit blind um, and not know so I haven't looked at anybody else's readings I haven't looked at anybody else on YouTube um, that you know the sleuths the true crime detectives that go through all the details I haven't looked at any of those usually on the first layer of a when I look into a case for the first time I like to go in blind and I like to go in one layer one layer deep and not have too much knowledge or information there just so i can see what i can get first distractions that's the reason why um because i feel like it dis it distracts me too much on what other people are saying distracts to the messages that i'm getting through
Mm. Okay, I just I was asking if Sarah was connected. Um, and this is all alleged, in my opinion. This is just the cards. There's no facts here. Um, the cards had trouble pulling on that one. They wouldn't give me any information on that one. But all they did give me was the um, the ending. The bur that's um, buried in the earth card. That's my buried in the earth card. So perhaps there was somehow there was a connection to that somehow. Um, okay, I asked if she was connected to the death, and it gave me male energy, emperor, male energy for that, suspected motives, and I feel like that is like watching somebody else, so it's like... Well, that she's a suspect could be read that way or somebody around her is a suspect and may not even be somebody that's in her vicinity or circle because we had that deal with the devil and stranger unknown Um, again, deal with the devil. So what I, what I did, what I asked was if the person that was involved in the event was known to her. It says deal. It's a back, bringing me back again to the deal. To deal. So where I said it may not even be somebody in her network, where she made a deal with somebody, it's related to that person. Again, it's come out again that way. And again, this contemplation card is giving me that feeling when I was tapping to that energy of that female before, um, almost remorse or head down, head down for some reason, head down. Still thinks about it. Okay, well, I'm going to ask if she's seen the crime. Because that's the only name that I know at the moment. It's the only person I know involved in this at the moment. That's why I'm only reading on this person. And again, this is all alleged. Um, strategy and planning. Again, that's somebody walking somebody. Strategy and planning. And I've kind of forgotten the question. I don't know if I even asked a question. I think I was asking, we're getting the same cards over and over again, which is a sign that the cards are, there's a hundred cards in here. So when the same cards fall out over the top, over the same, over and over again, it's saying these are the cards that need to be pulled. These are, these, these are the, sto this is a story. Okay, unaware, oblivious is coming out again. Something exposed. Level of strategy and planning that was involved in it. Accomplice. So somebody was an accomplice. So it's indicating more than one person. Somebody helped another person. Perhaps they helped them lead the child away. So maybe that was separate to over here. Because see how the cards have separated. So it's like the part where the child was led away was an accomplice separate to because they're unaware of that unaware of the strategy or the planning of what was to take place the reason behind it I mean things being exposed or secrets being exposed Maybe there was a reason because they had to do this, otherwise some other secret would be exposed. Not sure on that one, but I've got to say it because it's a way that this can be read. So unaware of 
the planning or what was actually planned exposed or uncovered so that they were, that was exposed or there was fear of being some hat participating in that because something else was going to get exposed it feels more like ex okay so these cards keep coming out so let's I'm just going to have a pull another card here Sorry, um, tied down. The reason I put that back then because I hadn't finished forming a question when it fell out. <laughs> Hermit alone, again, hadn't finished the question. Okay, I asked if she saw the crime. What came out was um, the aggressive attack and the war card. So war, um, the Mars card is about it's violence and um, aggression or strong energy because that's Mars. So And then it sits next to the aggressive attack. But watching, so that can indicate that she did see because I asked if she saw the crime and it said watching. So perhaps she did see it. But there's again a level of regret there that's come up around that. It was a repeat offender. Somebody had done this before. And a need to review the facts. Maybe there's a need to review people in that area, vicinity I'm hearing. The people in that vicinity that have a past history. And if there's any inkling of connection there, it doesn't feel to be a strong connection. It feels like a, you know, a couple of layers back. Okay, so I'm just going to look at these in another way if I can. There was a level of strategy or planning involved that... The accomplice was not aware of. Um, the person that led him away was not aware of. But that was exposed to them. They got that. They were exposed to that. Okay, down here at the actual crime, they saw the person here that made the deal with the devil or took the child, which caused a level of regret may not even be Sarah, it may be somebody else, I don't know. I definitely felt female energy in there in one way, but then it changed over to male energy, the like male energy there. So I feel the deal was made with a male, a repeat offender. A need to review those facts again, which is related to the first part of this video. And see if there's any connection between past offenders and as I said, I haven't looked into this case, so I don't know if they are offenders. I don't know. I don't know. But it's saying repeat offenders. And I'm adding an S to that, just slip of the tongue, so that's more than one. But reviewing the connections a couple levels back. No money cards here. I'm not seeing any money cards. Okay, let's ask why. Why did this happen? And again, at the moment, I'm not tapping into um, any any energy, but I did have a, long, a young boy come to me last night. OK, 
Okay, that's a little bizarre. I'm not sure what that was. I was talking about my visit last night and it came out as not involved. Moon means no, wrong direction. So maybe that child wasn't connected. Maybe that child is a different child from a repeat offender, but not um, Michael T T Joseph Vaughan. Okay, I've had no death cards here either, but I'm sorry, I did get the buried in the earth card. Okay, I'm going to ask why he went missing. <clears throat> Okay, now they're sitting over there for a separate reason. <sighs> okay, here we've got the deal with the devil again. Um, female energy here. Organised, so something was organised, um, or organised meetup related to the female to the deal with the devil. So repeating kind of what it already said. Um, split mind or men mental illness. So not quite right in the brain. This is also connected to my ring, ring master. Um, ring master. Which is ring. It means ring. But it's, it's not. It's the, it's the card that's attached to it. It's not the card. This card's all about mental illness. Ring master. So ringmaster did come out. Um, now jumped over separately, separate to this scenario, there is somehow a bigger picture to this that is connected to. Okay, that's weird because I yeah I think that they're trying to say that um, the bigger scheme of things, money may have been involved, or that there's lies around the big picture of this. Okay, any final words on this? Final words on this one, please. Okay, I'm not sure if I'll read on this one again. Um, I, like I said, I like to do different layers of it. Um, okay, first of all, can you link this case to a card, please, in case you want to talk about it again? same cards again um, mm. okay okay I'm not sure if there's any here that I want to link to this case it's all the same cards again so it's like the um, ringmaster split mind with the aggressive energy of the Mars or something was organized here is again lies there's somebody's lying about something deal with the devil and the female female energy here again so that deal made with the female um, but there's lies around it and something was organized could buy a ring um, and that's that aggressive energy also mental illness not on that card but mental illness right next to it behind it okay this is new um, says my fault I don't really want to link that card to it either okay any final words please Looking over here, again accomplice, um, more than one person involved. So this is related to that whole set of series of cards on planning, accomplice, more than one person, and the battles. Repeat offender. These cards fill out all together. So let's have a look what they say. Um, Um, 
temperance means patience. Okay, wrong direction, so... Needing to change direction. But be patient, that will take time to find those answers. Again, ringmaster. My no card, which is um, the moon, also means um, not seeing it clearly, not seeing the whole thing clearly. Um, a separation or a sadness here and needing to check the phone. So this is the phone card, so needing to check the phone history here. Okay. Thank you for joining me.